page, and I'll do the hyperlinks on the computer. But I so still we don't have paper. to print hyperlinks. Yes, that's what so I'm you saying. But I don't know how much. But you don't something need something to, to vote on. Well, the challenge with that is the hyperlinks provide a lot of the information. That's what I'm saying. So we get the people to go to the hyperlinks and get the <clears> extra <throat> information. You gotta have one or the other. You do? Really? Yeah. I didn't know that. How, how, we got people that can't use the damn computer. Kevin's handicapped. Amy's never opened hers. Mark has limited ability. Hell, Mike, Why do I need Mike to open started, it when it's up here? Mike started though when we were well, still on the telegram. Back, it says background information. Just as background information. Okay. So you can... If you're relying on that, you're going to have the information. Yeah, there's a very lot... There's a lot, the yeah, there's just a lot prepare of for the meeting by looking at the information. There's a lot it of... It looks like I did, Corey. But here's the thing, Corey. You don't have to have this computer to access it. When it gets sent out in the email, you can also access it there, too. I don't I'm not arguing that point. Okay, then. I'm not arguing that you point at all. You just called me alone. I'm going to space No, all of the... So, so I think the concern is... I think the concern is that um, we, we do not print, you know, the 50... Because I think for some people, individually, you like to know, like, what are those courses? So we try to give you as much information as possible. But on, you know, on this enrollment, you know, we we do a number of hyperlinks just to be able to share that, and we do not print all of that off. I mean, it, it currently takes Amy two days to print stuff off for you now. Um, to to do all of those hyperlinks when those are readily accessible for you. I'll make a motion to amend my initial motion. Where the hyperlink paper copies will be excluded from it. But noted? But noted. You have noted it, I see, in the past. <coughs> you know, in the if somebody wants to go, go down function. that path, they have the availability. Oh. You know what I mean? So. Sure. so if it's listed that way, you don't have to print out. Right. Anything that's blue is hyperlinked. Okay. So all you're getting on paper is the agenda? Or am I missing something? I want to understand. You're going to get the background information. You're going to get the background information. You're going to get all this. We're just not going into But, like, the background information, so I would have, the background information, you're not going to get yeah. all the hyperlinks. So you're just asking, I mean, is it more accurate to say you don't need PowerPoint presentations printed that would normally be a hyperlink? Or, because everything's yeah. a hyperlink. You get the, at least the way I look at it, I get the agenda. Right. Every, there's a hyperlink. I click on it. That's where the information is. So I want to make sure that whatever we're being amended to is accurate to what the intention is. Well, right now we're not getting the uh, hyperlinks. As far as the other ones, like Ann just said. Yeah, yeah. You're getting some. Quite a few I'm, of that's them. right. I'm getting some. Right. Yeah, and I'm making the assumption, quite honestly, that yeah. my packet won't change. Right. Currently, as provided, that was my initial comment. And I will so yeah. very often, you know, like this is a pretty big, our priority matrix is a pretty big, long thing, but we want you to know that we're constantly doing that when we're, you know, there's an expense. So if you're not, if you're not accessing the information electronically, you are missing information, I guess is my bottom line. Which means that you're not, everyone's not equally informed with the information to make decisions and hold relevant discussions. Over the years, I've heard several board members in this room whine about not being informed when all the information was there in hyperlinks and they weren't being utilized. If the board wants to make the commitment to accessing all of the hyperlinks, I mean, that's that's our job. I mean, we, we spend the month getting ready for tonight. And we want to make sure that you have information to make important decisions. So every item we try to say, do they need a little bit more? Well, they might want a little bit more. Christy, why don't you link in how many classes we have? Okay, that's great. Like, we really spend a lot of time making sure that you have a lot of information. So if, if the board would commit to saying that they're going to take a look at all of those hyperlinks, then, then you would have access to the information. I stand behind my motion of how it's currently being provided. All right, so Kevin, you made an amendment to your motion originally to maintain the way the board is already receiving to, can you repeat what you did? Yeah, the first amendment was quite honestly to, to exclude the hyperlink, but as, as uh, Mr. Barnes here pointed out, that could reflect an inappropriate a reflection of information and not as currently it is provided. So back with my original motion as the packets are currently provided. And then as we pick up, we need to put that. Nope. Nope. 
and that wasn't part of the motion. So, so we have a motion yet standing by Kevin and second by Kelly. Further discussion? There's no way to make sure every board member has the same information. There's no way to confirm that everyone's open to those hyperlinks. Therefore, no, Cody, you, there is a, you can't make everybody open a computer. Thank you for thank you for uh, there is, pointing You're that right, out. and probably haven't been either. So what, what, what are we going to do? You haven't been. Mm -hmm. Thanks for confirming that. Mm -hmm. So it, then I would I, I would make the motion that we we have abandoned all the computers and abandoned the board books, save the cost because we have to pay for the printing cost to keep everybody out. Would you like to make that in the form of motion? Oh, I just did. All right. Is there a second to Corey's motion? No second. Okay, so we have a motion by Corey and a second by Mark. But we're going to go ahead and just so we clear up the first motion. Well, let's have a discussion on your, your motion, Corey, because I want to understand what you're saying. And now you're changing the rules. You either no. discuss their well, no, I, wanna, you, I would you, like you to repeat you your motion. Off that. If you want Please to play repeat. the game with two motions on the 4 1 time, yes. Robert, you've been studying, studying Robert's rules. Why, why well, is it a game? So would you, you have Corey, to, would you read you your motion? Follow it. Amy, excuse me, Corey. Would you repeat his motion, please? The motion was to abandon the, the technology and board books. Well, that's kind of a separate motion to the first motion, basically. Still, you have two motions on the floor. You started off doing this process, then you have to follow the process the same okay. way through. So you address each motion in order. Yes, we will vote now, on eight, the seven, first three. motion as presented. Is there any discussion or questions on the first motion presented by Kelly, second, or I'm sorry, by Kevin, second by Kevin? I think that it's. I think that that is a, a not acceptable uh, way for this board to run because it does not guarantee that every board member has the same amount of information to, to have uh, intelligent and fully informed decisions on the business for the board. Because as Kelly so eloquently pointed out, you can't force someone to open a computer. So then we shouldn't have any computers. Is the reason I brought the second motion. And if we're going to talk about board items. Everybody needs to have the same issue. Time and time again, in, in previous um, boards, in the last couple of years, I've, had, I've heard board members going, oh, I didn't get this, or I didn't see that, or I didn't have that. So that, that disrupts the ability of the board to make an informed decision. I cannot support that. Is there any other discussion? Well, I feel if you just go to paper only, it was to guarantee that people are even looking through the papers. Okay. Okay. Everyone's presented on the even deal. And my motion has a, you know what, you have the ability to use your order. Whatever you feel most comfortable, however you retain information the best. Exactly. Okay. We do have a motion yet and a second by Kelly. Is there future discussion or more discussion? Excuse me. Yes. So, did I understand it? The motion as presented on the floor by Kevin does not change anything having to do with driving a 51 mile circuit or how board members re receive that paper information. It's just right? maintaining what we currently have. Okay, I can't support that. No, that's not in the motion that Amy has to drive, is it? No. Yes, it's yes it is. We've changing. The moment I wanted to amend that. Take that That's out. Not the yeah. have to make you want to amend that too. The, to yes. the printed board packets and the associated supporting materials be circulated as currently provided. Okay, so you want Amy to deliver yours. Quite honestly, I, I didn't think delivery was an issue. But I, I'm, I'm all interested. I'm interested in getting the right information. Quite honestly, so we can make informed decisions. So if I have to go to the to the um, boulevard here to pick up my stuff, I will. That's the intent here. The intent is to do the right things for the cause. Right, right. Well, then we have to have you have every hyperlink printed. Right now, not everyone is currently printed. So then you're not getting the same information as everyone else? No, actually, I get enough information to navigate with what I need. I don't think we're going to throw the email that's sent out to you yeah. as well. I'm not There's questioning whether you can navigate. I'm questioning whether you're getting the same information or not. Okay. Can we put in a number to that if he's okay with that? Or does he have to 
Okay, I will. So I'll, I'll amend my motion to exclude to exclude the distribution that currently is being done by our administration that the packets are provided and for pickup no later than 3 p.m. on Thursday at the administrative offices. So you're making that a form of a third motion? Yes. Do you have a second? I'll second. Okay, we're going to have to go. Is there discussion on this? Okay. What, what happens if nobody picks up, if somebody doesn't pick up their information by Thursday at 3 p.m.? Well, that would be... Sometimes we just leave, Corey, right? because people don't show up and it's 6 o'clock at night. So sometimes we do just leave. So then the board member has less time to prepare? Well, they still have it on email. <coughs> they still can do it electronically. So do we have to print everyone, or do we have, we know who's coming? Uh, so. That is up to the individual board member on how they're going to get their package. So each, in, each individual board member has to call in for that month and say, hey, I, I need one nope. in paper, i got to nope. call it. Nope. So then how, do, how, do, how does the staff know how to prepare? they got to print everybody, already. every every. It's packet. ready on Thursday. She knows everyone. So my question is, hey, she has to pay, because what if I show up? What if I want in paper one month? Well, then you should tell her. Yes, that's your nope, That's my question. Yeah. Amy always shoots out an email saying that she'll be delivering the board packets to those who get delivered. She won't be, instead of her saying that she's going to be delivering them, she will say they'll be ready to pick up at this time at the district office. So the email will be differently than how she sends it now. If we're going to do pickups, we better have a sign form and date them. Okay, so we currently have three motions on the floor. Is there any other discussion on any of the three of the motions? Can't discuss multiple motions at one time. We will vote on the first motion. Amy, could you please read that first motion back so everybody knows what they're voting on? Um, that was Kevin's motion Correct. to continue to have the board packets presented. Find it. As they're currently. Uh, yeah, okay. currently distributed. So, okay, we will be voting on that motion in which the board packets are, there's no change. They're coming to you the exact same way that we are now. So we have a motion and a second. All those in favor? Opposed? Aye. 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 Motion carries. Uh, I'm sorry, opposed on number one. Number two, that would be Corey's motion, in which we will be getting rid of all of our electronic devices. Okay. And instead of paper. All those in favor? Aye. Opposed? Aye. That motion will fail. Motion three. <clears throat> Currently the way the board packets are with the exception that they will be picked up by the board members that are requesting that. All those in favor? Aye. Is there, is there time? Are we setting a hard fast time in that motion or is it just that we you pick can't, up? That you can't because that's you have a policy. Gets them down, yeah. I, I just wasn't sure if it was in the motion. There was like a three o'clock, and I didn't know. If no, it, it's like I said. She will send out an email. instead of sending an email. She's coming out to deliver the board packets. She's going to send an email. They're right. available. They're, they are available. They'll be ready. Boom. Okay, that's a better plan. You guys want to try it? Any other questions? No, I understand. Thank you. Okay. All those in favor? Would you read the motion. Amy, would you please? Uh, it, he had amend his prior motion with the exclusion that the distribution of packets are provided no later than 3 p.m. on Thursday at the district office for pickup. Wait a minute. I, I swear to God, I have an appointment in early July for yeah. my hearing aids, but I, I didn't catch it all. Okay. To, he amended his prior motion with the exclusion that the distribution of packets are provided no later than 3 p.m. on Thursday at the district office for pickup. So you can come anytime after Thursday, anytime Friday. It doesn't. One of them. The, mo the motion as it's worded does not require. The well, so one of the things is that the agenda will be mailed or delivered no later than three days prior. Okay. So your board policy says no, day, no later than three days prior. 
So it is possible on a given week that we might not have them ready till Friday. And that, that does not violate the board policy 0166. So if you make a motion that now changes that, that's a change to the policy. So if you just said, pick it up, pick it up. When we have it ready. There now normally, yeah. do I normally, need to make a motion to amend my amendment and my amendment here? <laughs> I think so. uh, the just intent just here is really good. Yeah, just I mean, include, it's, it just is a little take messy. Just take the time out. Yeah. You know just, I mean? take the, just exclude okay. the time. Just exclude the time, the time, please, on my motion then. Mm -hmm. I don't know if Kelly will second yeah, that. Thank we're, we're doing everything we can to get the information okay. to you as quick as we can, for sure. Okay. okay is there the any other discussion? The intent is good here. Well, Amy, would you please read the motion? <laughs> okay. To distribute the, the packets as currently provided, with the exclusion that the distribution of packets will be provided at the district office for pickup. Excellent. Any questions? All those in favor? Aye. Aye. Opposed? Aye. Motion carries.